height. The teams are in position now, and now they can settle things on the field. He's brought to a halt. Number 23 on the return. Here comes the man who's not afraid to throw it down the field, quarterback Jay Cutler. I think we saw last year when Jay Cutler was out of the lineup, the Chicago Bears offense completely fell apart. They had a hard time getting first downs, much less scoring any points. First and 10. Looking across the middle, they have their first first down of the game. Getting that first first down in the game, to me as a quarterback, was a lot like completing that first pass. It just feels good, uh, eases the pressure, puts you in rhythm, and you hope it keeps going from there. They've got a first down now after that catch. Back to the air here on first down. Makes the reception. The rhythm you hear it so often in sports, and it is true, especially on the offensive side. That's another first down by the offense. They got some rhythm, and these kind of these kind of drives usually lead to scores. Now first and ten. The handoff to Matt Forte. As we look at the lineups, don't overlook Matt Forte. He'll be handling the ball a lot today, you have to figure. I don't know who's more valuable to the Chicago Bears offense, Jake Cutler or Matt Forte. He's good in the passing game. He can make people miss. He is one terrific running back. And here's a look at the defensive line. that will try to control the trenches today. Nickel formation here for the defense. Third and two. He'll throw it over the middle. Just had to avoid the sack. Incomplete. Good job that time by the defense. They get the fourth down situation here. They were bending a little bit but they didn't give up the big play. Good job. Here comes a Super Bowl MVP quarterback, Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers was not asked to move as much as he does here in the NFL when he was in college, so we didn't know he was this dynamic, this quick of foot, and man, is he dangerous when he moves out of the pocket. First and 10. That's a two-point safety, and that means you also have to send the ball back to the other team with a free kick at the 20. Tackles made. What a job by the kickoff team. The hustle, everybody sprinting down the field and they get rewarded. They give great field position to their defense. First down, offense readying for the snap. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Tackle down at the 46-yard line. Good job that time by the quarterback. Man-to-man -man coverage down the field. When you see it, you got to be accurate with the football. He was that time, and that's why we got the completion. Second and one for Matt Forte gets it here. Nickel formation for the defense here. Third and three. Incompletion on that hurry throw. This defense can pressure the quarterback. There's no doubt about it. They did this time, and it was. Offense lines up here. The defensive line forging a strong front right up the middle, trying to work the middle of the field. He had no time to get set. When you look at the Packers on offense, there's so many weapons here, including Jordy Nelson. Jordy Nelson, he gets overlooked, Jim. I don't know why, because he can do everything. He can go down the field. He has the speed. And we've seen him so many times. Acrobatic catches on the sideline, able to control his body. He is terrific. 
This linebacking core is the heart and soul of this defensive unit. Third down after the completion. The corner step back. Snap back to the quarterback. Out of the gun. Has the reception all alone. Good job by the defense. Staying in the right spots. They give up the short pass. They make the tackle. And now we have fourth down coming up. Waves his arm, and he's going to make a fair catch. First down on the way. Quarterback drops back. Under pressure and incomplete. Terrible job by the offensive line. Your quarterback needs more time than that. Uh, another incompletion. Second down. Hand off. Hey, up the middle. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running it. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. He drops back to throw. Easy catch there. No one near him. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. First down here. Play action. And he wants to throw it across the middle. Bears get a first down. This is why I like quarterbacks who get underneath the center a lot. When you get underneath the center, you can deceive the defense because they cannot see where the football is. You can fake reverses. You can fake the run. You got these play action passes that generally work and get you some easy completions. That reception gave them the first down. Staying with the passing game on first down. And he is brought down at the 45-yard line. Hard to play man-to-man -man coverage all the time in the NFL. That time we see the man-to-man -man coverage, the quarterback sees it. Nice throw. That pass play picked up only four. Second down and six coming up. The quarterback will hand it off. The flag is out. The defense will not decline. They will take the penalty. And after that penalty on the offense, it's second down and 16. Nick Perry has the sack. Outside linebackers who can get to the quarterback, they are a rare breed in the NFL because it takes talent, size, speed, everything to do it as a linebacker. And we saw it that time on display. Play number six coming up on this drive. Drop back, shotgun formation. Throwing now to his left. The pass doesn't find the ball. 